Hey, what's going on guys? It's Rondo or Rondini here, bringing you guys another video on the channel today. And you guys can see by the title, it's end up going to be a Skolas kill. That was 37 seconds or faster. It's pretty insane. Um, really cool mission. It's the level 35 Prison of Elder Strike or Raid Arena, whatever you guys want to call it. It's really cool. It's the last boss that you capture in the story missions. It's pretty intense, uh, pretty tough one too because you're a one level skill skill gap because you're level 34. But um, yeah, it's pretty cool. Oh wait guys, crap, I have to fight Skolas right now. I'll be right back. So yeah, that was pretty insane, right? Uh, we ended up killing Skull Loss in 37 seconds or faster. I had that timer for you guys could, so you guys could see it. But um, it's pretty fun. I really enjoyed the level 35. It's pretty challenging at first, but since it was me, my friend Alex, um, he's a really cool dude of mine. He's in the Doom Clan as well. And then also Mud Dog, um, pretty big supporter of the Doom Clan. We ended up doing that. Um, so fast we had two titans with blessing and weapons and then we all had three gal horns 365 because it is solar burn so it's a uh, stronger the solar does more damage but also since skolas has the scorch cannon as you guys see when i die in it um you can get one shot really easily because scorch cannon is solar so um i ended up getting melted right at the end but if you uh, run the right strategy, this isn't the legit way like some people would say. Um, usually what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to go around the maps, um, killing the servers and then defusing the land, the mines at the end. But we do it the really fast way. You just destroy. You guys can see from Enraged Cinema's videos and other people that have done it um, in Cooch. Um, you can kill them really fast doing it this way with three Galhorns, 365. And I was a level 33, which made it a lot, a lot harder for us. But um, it was pretty fun. Um, I already have a 34 now as my Titan, and what you end up earning after beating Skolas is obviously when you go into the treasure room, you get Aerithic, Light, you get a Judgment Core, Weapon Core, you end up getting House of Judgment points, and then also you get a Shader, um, an Emblem, and then also a Gun, and then I think it's something, something else, I don't remember the exact complete earnings. But it's pretty cool, and the one thing too is you only get this on one character. So whatever you do your first character on Skolas, this is the this is the only time you'll be getting that stuff. So make sure to pick the character you want to get everything on right away. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to smash a like for the 37 second kill on Skolas and the loot at the end. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys need to want another one, just leave a comment down below and drop a like. I'll see you guys on another video. This is Rondo Arandini. See you later, YouTube.